Paradox researchers know that tensions come in multiples, but too often they isolate them in order to study them. They look at them in the context of actors' interviews, and they isolate them uh, in those interviews and then build models around them and other tensions in the discussion section of their research reports. Uh, instead of preserving the wholeness of actors' accounts, that is, listening to actors talk about how tensions interrelate, uh, how tensions may attenuate or uh, exacerbate one another. Uh, in other words, looking at how tensions knot and interweave. Uh, and by preserving the wholeness of actors' accounts, we begin to see what is the nature of the interrelationship between tensions. Uh, I think too often uh, paradox researchers ignore this data uh, in the interview accounts that they collect. And by looking at these uh, knotted uh, formulations, what we can begin to see would be uh, greater degrees of variance uh, across actors, indicating different levels of reflexivity, but also the ability to build models around disorder and disequilibrium. Uh, so if I had more time, I could explain further, but uh, those are my uh, two cents. Thank you.